just want to thank you for the show. You are, you are better than all that. I'm a man, I'm a man, I'm a trophy. I'm a trophy. I want to be a trophy. I want, I want a trophy. This is my boyfriend. Hence the way we're sitting together and he's holding me. Sex is exhausting. Hey y'all, it's Odyssey back at it with another <sighs> Hey y'all, it's Honesty back at it with another uh -huh video. I'm hoping you do it well. Cause I am as well. Was that too much? <laughs> Do you think that was too much? Do I need to? <laughs> so today we will be talking about my unpopular opinions celebrity edition. Because oh, hold on, hold on, got to get a character real quick. I didn't expect this. I didn't expect this. I didn't expect this. I didn't expect this. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Oh my gosh, this is, this is truly a blessing. I've been named Celebrity of the Year. Turn me up, turn me up. And as that celebrity, I'm not too fond of other celebrities in the community. I'm not. I'm not. Ari, sit down. Jada, sit down. Chris and Queen and Clarence, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. Take your seats now, please, and thank you. All right, as I was saying. I didn't come here to be liked, and I didn't come here to like people. And that's what we're gonna talk about today. That's what we're gonna... Ari, you know about all this? That's what we're gonna talk about today. All of this is what we talk about today. Kayla Nicole, I love you. I love you. And it's just an honor coming here. 344 subscribers in and already have an opinion and a right to speak my mind. Am I thick? Is that even a question? <laughs> Am I right? Am I right? Is that a question? Who not thick? Who, who not thick? Who, who? All right. <laughs> All right, thank you, thank you, here you go. Drops mic, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. Thank you. Honestly, in a dress, you know how long it's been since I've been in a dress? We looking futuristic, ah, uh, if you don't like my outfit, and ah, uh, if you do, okay? Oh, I'm getting a phone call. Hello? I be double dog damn. The man call me back. Call me back. I'm going downstairs. I'm going downstairs, and I'm gonna cut up. You're oh, he, he called me back. Call the drunk ain't smart. <laughs> Hello. Oh my bad. This is celebrity edition. I'm a celebrity right now. My bad. I just called to say I love, I you. love you. Love you, honestly. Love you, honestly. Okay. Okay. Sorry. You look famous. I do. <laughs> Thank you. I forgot what I was saying. Well, the story is there aren't too many things I fancy celebrity wise. We're going to talk about them. Unpopular slash might be popular opinions if you're semi woke like me, because I'm only semi woke and not really woke. But you know, if you get what I'm picking up and putting down, you feel me? You agree, you agree, you don't, you don't. It's unpopular slash popular, maybe, who knows? I don't know. And I look like men in black. Let's get into it. I think that Nicki Minaj should have her crown snatched away, her throne taken from beneath her. 
And I mean every last word of that. Hit me. Who gonna beat me up? Beat me up. You can probably beat me up with my hands like this because it don't look like I'm about to do nothing. So I'm like, let me go. Let me, let me go, please. The fact that she just is with a man who sexually abused a child. And she knows that. That whole Will and Jada? Will and Jada. Let's let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. You ready? I'ma get straight to it because I don't wanna have y'all waiting no more. You ready for this? I don't need my shades when I say this because this is so deep to me and I need y'all to understand what I'm about to say. And I really, I don't want any confusion because when I tend to say things, it's not expressed the right way. So people take it in a different way, okay? So we're gonna talk about this. Will and Jada, you ready? <laughs> See my men in black shades. Will and Jada, that's none of your damn business. It's none of your business. Like, I'm not understanding why my generation is so bad with just just staying out of grown folk business because that's all it is now the entanglement thing that was funny that was very, that was hilarious but at the end of the day they grown some people taking jada's side some people taking will's side ultimately there's no side to take because it's not our business more of the story is grown folk business they know what they're doing at the end of the day they they got how many millions billions whatever and we sitting here broke thinking about them Another unpopular slash popular opinion, B. Simone gotta go. I was a stand for her for a while. I Even when people were talking about her book and everything, I was like, what? No, don't come for her. But then when she talked about people who work nine to five, so that's why I, I tuned out. You lost me there, sis, because you know how many nine to fives I've had? Enough. You know how many people have great paying nine to fives? A doctor is a nine to five. Come on now, baby. Shut up. Sorry, B. Simone. Oh well, I wish the best to you. I hope you are gonna find your boyfriend da -da 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 one day, someday. Uh, I don't think NBA Youngboy has herpes. I, something in me, like as much as people wanna say that he has a crunch bar penis, I don't think it's bumpy like that because he, Either he is bumpy like that, and girls are just like, oh, money, NBA, danger, 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 I love it. Or he doesn't, and that's how he's getting all these women. I feel like at least by now he would have got rid of it. He could have had it once upon a time. He could have been itching and burning once upon a time. But I, I truly don't believe that right now he has herpes. I don't like Ari. I don't, I don't fancy her. I, I just, I don't. It's like, when I first saw it was Gierbo and Ari, I was like, oh, she violent. I think she domestically violences him and he might do it back, but she's too angry for me. But hey, she got more M's than me. So she's doing something right and I'm doing something wrong. Right now, Lil Wayne looks like a recovering crack addict. Lil Baby is trash in a good way though. If, if it matters that I added that, even though I just called him trash. I don't like it. I mean, let me not say he's trash, even though I think he's trash, but he's he can be talented sometimes, and some of his music is good sometimes to other people, but to honesty, it's just not tickling my fancy. It sounds like everyone else. It, it doesn't speak to me like Jermaine speaks to me. Then again, a lot of people don't speak to me like Jermaine speaks to me, so if Jermaine speaks to me in real life, I might just, hmm. A lot of people don't like 50 Cent, I like 50 Cent. I love 50 Cent. I just, he's so messy. To see a messy guy, it's funny to me. It's its its actually comical. Like, to have your name pop up, he's smart. Because, you know, in the club back in the day, Candy Shop, that was that was the 2000s. He did his part then. Then he gets his business rolling through the 2000s and the 2010s. Now he knows social media popping off. You don't know 50 Cent. You, I don't care how old you are, you know him and you know how messy he is, so he did something right. So I love 50. I don't like Future anymore. I don't. Like, he was. I love innovation. That's the future I love because he seems so genuine. Now he just seems like he's speaking for the dumb people. He's a voice for the dumb and the ignorant. All them tweets that he be putting up, them everybody that retweet, repost, re like, re everything, a degenerate.
it's not a good message doesn't feel good but you know he's making more m's than me so more power to him thank you next sweetie her music isn't good like if she doesn't sample she's not gonna sell tap in was a good tiktok song she's pretty like she's really pretty and i'm pretty sure she's a beautiful soul but her music is trash <laughs> trash basura basura it's horrible the kardashians are the smartest dumbest people i know it's it's amazing it it's it's actually brilliant i i wish i wish instead of college we had the school of the kardashians because if we learn more from them we would all be millionaires okay they are they are actually real geniuses kim alone the powerhouse thank you kim along with yay just the, the, the strategies the, it's immaculate it's very tasteful. Uh, Charlie D'Amelio, or is that how you say it? Is that how you say it? Being the celebrity that I am, I just don't even take the time to pronounce things right anymore. I just don't. Anywho, she's a genius. Like, people, and I'm guilty of it too, I didn't see anything special about her at first. I still don't, but she's doing something right. So y'all need to give her her credit because she got more money than y'all, sorry. Talk your junk if you want to, but Charlie making moves. Quarantine or no quarantine, and we still in here eating expired popcorn and canned sausage. Oh, Shane Dawson belongs below the jail. And you got people in the comments defending him like, oh, he didn't sexualize a, a minor. He was just joking. He was using the N word as a joke. All right, for you and him, can I kiki key your asses under the jail? together <laughs> Regine, i still don't like her from when she was on what was it i don't was it growing up hip-hop it was something where Regine was on and she is a brat or maybe people change their ways but she was such a brat on that show that it just irritated my soul that now even when i see her doing good things and being beautiful on the social media i still remember that brat and it it disgusts me it makes my stomach turn it makes my eyes twitch and it makes my eyebrows itch and i am disgusted I gotta understand this isn't honestly speaking this is honesty with an accent i can i've 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 made my money i'm a celebrity i can speak and think what i want then when you then you, you get the other honesty the one who's trying to make it she is just happy that all these people are making money she's happy that these people are happy she's not i'm not hating in real life right now i i am because i'm a celebrity and i do what i want but she She's at peace. She she's okay. Y'all didn't remember that when Lord had that performance. Come on, teeth on wedding rings in the movie. Iconic. That was an iconic moment. That didn't even scare me. People were talking so much junk about that, and I was like, <sighs> clutching my pearls. I loved it. This is fun. So I hope you guys like my unpopular slash probably popular opinions because I was going off the dome, you feel me? So if you agree, like. If you disagree, like. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. So we're gonna pray on that note. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for allowing me to come here once again to my lovely cousins. They are beautiful spirits, Lord, and I just ask you to keep them on the right path. And whatever they want to do in life, keep them at peace with themselves, Lord. And just pray that you give them all happy, healthy, wealthy, prosperous lives, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Y'all have a lovely day.